Over 2,000 women answered this question, and here's what they had to say. Why don't you want to have sex with your husband? They have shared many reasons, but those reasons all fall into two simple and distinctive categories. I have decided to share those reasons in hopes that both men and women will pay attention, make a few changes, and then get happy. A little background information can also be helpful. One, feminine is always attracted to masculine. Every intimate love and relationship, straight and gay, has masculine and feminine. It seems that this is the law of relationships and cannot be avoided. In heterosexual couples generally, the man displays masculine energy and the woman feminine. Gay couples always have one partner who is more masculine and the other who is more feminine. Whether straight or gay, the feminine is attracted to the masculine and vice versa. This seems to be a law of nature. When an imbalance occurs, dysfunction follows. If, for example, a woman displays too little feminine energy for her man, he loses interest. When a man displays too little masculine energy for his woman, she loses interest. 2. Adults only want sex with other adults. Sexual intimacy between humans is designed to be conducted between two consenting adults. If one partner exhibits too much childish or immature behavior, then his or her partner will naturally lose interest. For example, if a partner, male or female, behaves like a child, the natural incest taboo is activated and the other partner who is behaving as an adult or a parent will naturally avoid sexual contact. Adults and parents are programmed to avoid sexual contact with children even if that child is physically over 21. What follows are reasons or examples of things men do or don't do that cause loss of sexual interest in their partners. Most, if not all, can be connected to points one and two. Too little masculine energy or behavior or too much childishness. Now remember, I'm not implying here that men are full to blame for the lack of sexual contact with their partners. I'm simply putting the focus that there are some responsibilities that they need to take so they can make meaningful changes that will usually make large differences. Lack of sexual energy in a couple is always a result of behavior by both partners. If you are a man and you have decided that this issue is entirely your wife's problem, then you will have missed the point entirely. Focus on yourself. That's where the payoff will be. So why won't your girlfriend or wife have sex with you? There are two basic reasons that apply to over 95% of the men who have this difficulty. Reason number one, you don't act like a man. Reason number two, you don't act like an adult. I imagine you don't like either of these reasons and you're probably feeling defensive and possibly angry at me for being so blunt. So my question to you is, do you want more sex or do you want to stay defensive and unhappily celibate? It's your choice. Here's some more information that you'll need to know. Reason one, you don't act like a man. What do I mean by you don't act like a man? I mean your woman the one you want to be sexually attracted to, sees your behavior and your attitudes and thinks that you are too wimpy or neurotic, too careful, not assertive enough, too much of a whiner, not protective of her. You don't take the lead enough, too often anxious and indecisive, boring, run away from conflict, too passive, lack of passion, lack of self-respect, too much of a nice guy when you need to be tough. Avoid dealing with difficult people and situations and don't take risks. Notice, I didn't say that you don't make enough of money or you're not in great shape. These may be a factor in extreme circumstances, but they're not in the top 20 reasons why you don't get what you want from her. Yes, we are in an age that encourages men to be more sensitive and vulnerable and feel unaware those qualities may make her like or even love you but they will not make her feel like jumping your bones 
Your woman wants a man, a real man, and not a wimp. I know this is hard to hear, but if you want more sex, right? That is what you want. If you want her to get excited about you, get turned on, and get ready to give you the best sex you ever had, then you need to understand the things we just talked about. Do not, do not become defensive and start listing the ways you are not the way she thinks you are. Being defensive is another guaranteed way to make her as cold as ice. So here is even a harder question. Are you man enough to face the truth about your level of manliness and make positive changes? If you are, then here are some suggestions that I have given many men in your position. The ones who found the balls to follow my guidance are having a lot more sex. Why did I say this takes balls? Because it does. It takes real courage to face one's inadequacies, especially as it relates to being a man, and do something positive about them. Remember, courage is a big turn-on to your woman. If you want more sex, pay attention and make some manly decisions. She will love you for it. Reason two, you don't act like an adult. Countless wives make statements like this one. I gave birth to two children, but I often feel like I have three. These wives are totally turned off sexually because they experience their husbands as immature or childish. Adult women do not find children or adolescents sexually attractive, as I stated earlier. Adult human beings are naturally structured to avoid sex with children or adolescents. If a wife has a constant experience of her husband as immature, she will quickly lose a desire to connect with him sexually. Yes, he may be a good guy, and yes, he may have quite a few positive qualities. However, if he acts like a child too often, she will not want to go near him in bed. A man, a husband, will be seen as childish or adolescent if he frequently grabs his wife's butt like a teenager makes adolescent jokes, refuses to take adult responsibility for bills, ordinary household chores, and child care, takes his children's side against his wife, does not practice good hygiene, tries to turn all physical contact into sexual foreplay, makes sports, watching or viewing more important than quality time with her, cannot even be emotionally intimate acts like blowjobs are the ultimate sexual experience, refuses to learn to dress himself appropriately, does not pick up after himself, has to constantly be reminded to handle normal responsibilities, avoids disciplining the children. The list is endless, but the point is clear. Too many men act like children, and then they get upset because their wives go cold to their advances. If you want more sex, pay attention and make some adult decisions. She will love you for it and she'll want you more in the bedroom.